Cuba is disproportionately affected by the climate crisis and the brutal U.S. blockade that blocks supplies like syringes during the height of the COVID crisis and equipment for climate disaster relief. We had to illegally, illegally bring millions of syringes into Cuba because they came up with the vaccines, but because of the blockade, they didn't have syringes. Despite the six-decade blockade and sanctions, Cuba shows the world the way forward and how we need to organize to prepare for the worst of the climate disasters and to build infrastructures of care needed for our survival. Cuba has a lot to teach us about sustainability, resilience, and cooperation in the face of environmental uh, challenges. Cuba shows us a better world isn't just possible, it already exists. But daily life in Cuba is getting harder and harder each day that the sanctions and the blockade goes on. We see how this crushing blockade is crushing the needs of the people. We see how the illegal occupation of Guantanamo is polluting the surrounding environment. We see how the media war on Cuba is spreading lies so that the U.S. people don't understand the real impacts of the blockade. That's why we're here today, why we need to talk about Cuba and why more broadly we need to talk about U.S. militarism and imperialism wherever we go. I went to Cuba for the first time with many of you two years ago. And I, I think of them daily. We met with uh, local Cubans across the country, teachers, doctors, farmers, workers, artists, black and trans activists. No government is perfect. And they are all wanting to improve the conditions of their lives there without the blockade. We know that the vast, vast majority of peoples around the world stand against the cruel U.S. blockade. We fight with them and we build our future of centering people from Cuba to Palestine and those suffering in this very country from the U.S. war machine here at home. Biden must end the blockade unconditionally so that Cuba can continue to be the beacon of sustainability and cooperation for the rest of the world.